Hey, what's going on guys? It's Wolves here and welcome back to another episode of How To Minecraft and today we are going to be working on the front entrance to the Wolf Castle uh, as I am floating on what- oh, there's the lily pad. You saw it. I just ruined- I ruined the whole illusion. But we are here. We're going to be working on the front of this level of place. I wanted to get some building done like promised uh, just to get this thing rocking and rolling and that's what this uh, How To Minecraft episode is going to be about. So obviously, if you're pumped, stick around, check it out, have a good old day. Uh, uh, lean back and don't and just just kind of just kind of chill. Okay, it's just it's just chill. First, we gotta get rid of this this silly button that um, was implemented. Um, let's get rid of that button. That's that's step step one. And uh, before we start really and dip completely into the building and work, uh, obviously if you guys want to support the series, make me happy and save the kittens. Make sure to hit that like button down below. You guys have been killing it lately. Pretty much crushing, like, crushing, crushing, crushing like three thousand likes on every episode. That's really cool. So I was looking. At this place and I, I like the fact that it has this kind of crown you know what I mean that kind of looks like the top of the head so we're really gonna be working on that area today uh, and just in increasing the size of that making it a little bit more noticeable giving it more of, of a panaz maybe even making the actual uh, face bigger as well uh, but definitely working on the upper side of this lovely lovely castle let's go a little bit closer and uh, take a little look-see uh, into what we're doing here, but definitely what I want to do is I want to get the uh, the front of our base because it's a project that we started I want to get it done uh, it, It's definitely really important to have a good-looking base And I really want to move on to some bigger and better projects at this point like our uh, Grinders and, and finish up our mob grinder and our XP farm uh, as well as going to the end and building um, Finding the end first I know I know I think Tyler found it on the server But I want to find it as well uh, or just ask him where it is and build an enderman farm uh, so we can get an infinite amount of ender pearls um, as well as a couple of other things, explore the nether to find something so we can get more blaze rods uh, and build a blaze spawner. Just, I mean, there's so much stuff to do and we can't really start it until we get this build done. So I don't want to do anything too crazy. I don't want to have, you know, unreal thoughts as to what we're going to get accomplished. Uh, but at the same time, I want to get working on it. Uh, hold on. I actually was playing UHC earlier today, so my volume is a little high. So let's just reduce that. But the first thing I need to do is I actually found a ton of dirt over by my ice farm because I was over there. That's another thing I actually want to work on, guys, is the um, is get a little shop going that sells ice because I do have that ice farm and it is uh, it is pretty sweet. Uh, I definitely want to be using that a little bit more. So anyways, um, we have this situation. Uh, you know what? Let's just do this real quick just so we can finish building this wall here. We know what we're, we're working with. Um... But our situation is that the front of our place is not looking as good as it should and could. And it really needs to be doing that. Because I want people, you know, to, when, when push comes to shove, I want them to want to team with me. I want to be intimidating. I want to be scary. I want to be taken seriously. And uh, King Wolf is going to get taken seriously uh, 100%. And we're going to do that by making it so that whenever someone comes to our lovely little humble abode, they are petrified for their lives. So that's... That's the plan. You don't want to be you don't want to be messing with the wolf. That's that's essentially what the motto is. Don't mess with the wolf unless you want to rest with the fishes. That would you know it'd be great if that rhymed. It didn't. We're gonna roll with it. That's our motto. Okay. We'll work on it. All right. We're gonna we're gonna put a we'll put a pin in it and we'll come back to it later. <laughs> um. So ooh, is this coarse dirt? Oh, you silly silly coarse dirt. How how I don't actually want you right now. Remember the good old days where he pranked Salty Lagoon. Feels like literally forever ago that that happened. The good old days, man. The good old days. Uh, we haven't done a prank in a while. Besides the small cact uh, cactus prank on Preston. But, you know, that was a little cute one. So, anyways. Uh, let's build this up. Let's go ahead and just fill in all of this little area here. Uh, just want to try and make it not as artificial. I know I could just cover the the edges. But, you know, who knows uh, what we're going to be doing in the future. want to make sure that we try and get this done as uh, best as possible. And we do have the dirt to uh, to make it happen so we're gonna fill in as much as we possibly can and also just when we're building later on and we you know we don't find random holes or something it'll just be better overall uh, but yeah you know we're not really gonna be messing with up here that much because I don't know we have a lot of stuff going underground you know we built our inside tunnel we uh, we're gonna do a little bit of work by the uh, by the the rail cart system like there's no real reason to come outside too much except to greet my uh, friends and enemies in the near future so both nervous and excited for that for sure. So either way, check this out. We're going to get this all kind of pumped up here. Uh, like I said, definitely have the dirt to make it happen. But I do want, like, I want this to all be filled in. You know what I mean? I want 
the mountain to be bigger than the face, if that makes sense. Um, and I'm not a not not a not a Game of Thrones reference. Um, literally, uh, the mountain needs to be big. Um, oh my God, the hound. That's what my place is. It's the hound, and this is the mountain behind it. Wow. G O T. Uh, all right, let's just eat real quick. That is pretty awesome. That is pretty awesome, Gregor. You make I'll make you I'll make you proud, man. I'll make you proud. You are defeating the mountain. Anyways, um, so let's go ahead and just fill this up here. By the way, that wasn't a spoiler. That was literally just me rooting. Um, don't worry. I would never. I'm I'm an anti-spoiler, guys. You know that this channel is spoil-free. Uh, except I will tell you that uh, Harry Potter. Um, kills Dumbledore. Okay. <laughs> I'm totally messing with you guys. I actually, I had one show ruined for me back in the day. Um, it was 24. Uh, I don't know if you guys ever watched that awful show, but, um, I watched it. And my friend ruined the biggest plot twist of season one. And I was just like, <gasps> dude, why did you do this to me? And then I cried a little bit and I shed a couple tears and I still watched the darn show. So, they, you know, they, that that still happened, um, but I didn't enjoy it as much as I could have, and ever since then I've become very anti-spoiler. Like, I think the majority of the people of the world are. Like, I don't know someone who's like, yo, man, can you please spoil this show I'm watching? Like, I don't really, you know, unless you're not enjoying it, you're just like, ah, tell me the end, but... It's like, man, I really like The Walking Dead. Can you tell me what happens? It's like, oh yeah, sure, they're all dead, you know what I mean? Uh, again, not an actual spoiler disclaimer. Um, okay, so... Look at this, this is actually coming together really nice. We actually have a lot of dirt. Um, still got a couple stacks to go, which is awesome. We'll be able to really fill this. And this, having this kind of canvas almost, this background will allow us to, um, you know, have a, a greater opportunity to make the uh, the crown of this, uh, of this wolf a little better. Uh, or dragon, or whatever, octopus, whatever you guys see in it, whatever animal that you see out of this simple, simple front of my base design. If you see a hound or a wolf or um, you know, whatever it may be, then, uh, we, we shall make it even more badass and crown that, that, uh, that lovely beast. That lovely beast deserves a crown. Okay, so obviously this is looking not very au naturel, so we gotta give it some natural forms and, um, kind of connect it into here, you know, maybe, let's see how much, okay, we're running a little low on dirt, so we're gonna have to do this, uh, quickly, but kind of just give it a little bit of... A little bit of life. Now, this will all grow over. Maybe we can put some trees on it. Uh, maybe have some water flowing off of it just to make it kind of look super... <gasps> <laughs> Whoops! Um, maybe we can make it like super legit with just trees and grass and flowers, something like that. You know, kind of make it look real good. Uh, either way, let's just fill this in here. Just like this. Like that. And, uh-oh. One, two, three, four, five. <gasps> All right, we are we're donezo. We are donezo. All right, we'll give it some some good looks like that. I think that that'll do it. There we go. Sweet. Okay, let's uh, let's see what this looks like. I think we need to make it a little bit more arc arcing arching. You know what I mean? Make it a little bit more natural. Uh, this is a little bit too natural. <laughs> it's like, listen, I like natural. Like, you know, I'm not a fan of makeup or anything. I like natural. This is too natural. This is tray natural. Trey is a very in a Francais. I got you guys. Teaching you languages since 1997. Um, I did not start my YouTube channel in 1997. Another disclaimer. This is the episode of disclaimers, apparently. Oh, boy. What is what is happening to me? Okay. So, there we go. Uh, let's just edge this corner out a little bit. Boom. That's perfect. Uh, edge it out a little bit more. Okay. Let's uh, let's head on down and see what we're, work what we're working with here. How does this look? How does this look? All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. Because if we can get this look down, then we are looking pretty good. Um, we really, really care about what it looks like when you're coming through the, should be coming around the corner when she comes. All right, that looks sick. Perfect. That really does look like it's coming out of the mountain now. We got to just kind of trim off that side, but that's looking pretty sweet. That's looking pretty sweet. Um, what we can do is... Uh, let's work on let's work on that top crown area, which means we got to get rid of this dirt. We got to get some cobblestone out to get those cobblestone walls going, um, as well as some other really cool things. I think we can come up with a really cool design. Like we can really have fun with it. You know what I mean? Like there's all sorts of cool things that we can do. Uh, you know, we got some stone bricks. We got some stairs. There's just tons of tons of cool stuff. You know, tons of cool stuff that can be done. Uh, we got to place these pink tulips and white tulips. We could probably actually do that on top, just so that. 
you know, if people do come from the other way, uh, well, there will be a large wall that's protecting the entire uh, perimeter of this area. Uh, I do want to have some uh, some flowers there. You can have you can have a flower too, because I know you're feeling a little lonely, piece of grass. I got you. I got you. I know how you feel. I know how you feel being all lonely and stuff. I'm kidding. I have you guys. You guys keep me non-lonely. Um, all right, so just edge that out. There, that's perfect. Okay, great. Oops, it's a little bit too much. Uh, don't want to put coarse dirt. I'm silly. There we go. Okay, so let's put some some tulips and some white tulips and get it all nice and fresh up here. Um, okay, cool. So. Uh, let's rework this wall. Now, I do, like I said, really like what this looks like. Uh, you know, you got the stone brick, uh, the stone stairs down here. Um, let's continue with that style. Like, let's get this wall in. Uh, I actually, I do like this initial wall, but let's, like, pop it back, maybe. Like, we'll pop it back. You know what I mean? Like, it's looking all, all cool and stuff. Uh, like this. And what we'll do is maybe have it come up. Like that looks pretty sweet. And then right in the middle, uh, uh oh, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do right here? We have our stairs. We could put stairs behind it. Uh, thankfully, we have this crafting bench, so we are good to go to make some lovely stairs. Um, let's just do that. We'll make uh, we'll make another eight stairs. So if we put if we put stairs behind this, um, let's see here. All right, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. That's going to look like just normal blocks, though. I don't know how I feel about that with the dirt behind it. Okay, hold on. Let's let's get rid of the dirt. Let's get rid of the dirt, and we're going to put stone stone bricks. Okay. Um, let's see here. Okay, so two, and then... Oh, you know what? Let's just put... Oh, cobblestone's not really going to work. Let's do stone bricks. Yeah, let's do stone bricks. Okay, so stone bricks, just like that. Um, cobblestone wall. Uh, we can put slabs... That might be kind of cool. Uh, and then we can pop these walls out a little bit more. Maybe the, uh... Oh! Uh, hello there, eyes. You are looking fine and dandy. <gasps> you know what I want to do real quick? Uh, just a small little detail, because I have three blocks anyways. Boom. Just like that. I think that looks really cool. All right. Uh, let's jump on down here and see what we're working with. Uh, stone bricks look pretty cool, but we're going to have to bring that wall up. You know what? I don't... Man, unless we really wrap it around i think I, I think i know what we can do to make this look cool um but we're gonna have to get definitely some more cobblestone walls so let, let's make a whole bunch um there we go 60 and we're gonna need some stone some stone slabs too to make this a reality okay let's give this one more thing a try and we'll see what we're working with here because i actually think this will be pretty cool if we get like a nice big looking crown uh that could be pretty sweet i'm not going to lie I'm excited. I'm excited. I also got to make a better way to get up here because this is a little... <sighs> ho, ho, ho. That looks so cool. Oh, my lord. Okay, so a lot of people were saying... Not a lot of people, but I read uh, a comment or two about it. And they said they wanted me to implement lava. One person said they wanted to have lava flowing out of the eyes. Uh, maybe on command. Like a dispenser with buckets or something. Maybe. Maybe, but for now, let's work on this, and, and then I would be interested to see what you guys have to think, uh, what you guys think I could do to make this thing even more badass. Now, uh, I want to take care of the sides, so these pillars. Um, let's just uh, let's just put dirt here, let that grow a little bit. We'll bring these bad boys up. I think it would look. Yeah, I think it looks. I think it should be, you know, up. We should have them all equal. You know what I mean? Uh, and then maybe even. Hmm. What could we possibly do here? Yeah, we're just having fun with it now. We're just having fun with it, giving it some, some character. Because that's what Minecraft is all about. It's all about giving character to inanimate objects like buildings. But I like it. I like it. Uh, and then we can kind of cap these off maybe with the stone slabs. You know what? We can actually lower this a little bit. Let's really make this top stand out. Uh, not too much, not too much, but if we just cap these off, I think that would look pretty cool. Alright, just down a little bit. We just cap these off. Like that. Is that capped off at the same spot? Yep, okay. Uh, we cap these off. Let's put some more dirt back down here. What in the world? Oh my god, that flower's OP. Okay, like this. You know, maybe put some more here. Hmm. All right, let's give it a little look-see and see what we're... Oh! 
I just landed on that chicken. Okay, that's looking pretty sweet. That's definitely, I mean, it's definitely adding a little bit more dimension. Just a little bit, you know, but, you know, something. Um, I also want to, maybe we can add some nostrils. <gasps> oh, let's add some nostrils to this mother trucker. That would be so sick. Okay, so right here, if I do boom, boom, and then do... Hmm, if I do boom, ah, boom, boom. Okay, all right. Don't forget, this is not the the right fire. That's That, that fire is a little low because of my texture pack and PVPing. So... It does look a little bit different than default. Mm, that that looks way too high. Okay. It looks like his nostrils like the size of his entire face. So we're going to have to take at least down the stone slabs here. Um, but I do I do want to like texturize this a little bit. You know what I mean? I do want to give him some some love. Some, some actual depth. Uh, and I think that would be really cool. Uh, not like that. That's not that's no good. Maybe if we do this because it, this is too deep. This is, the, this is why I love Minecraft, though, guys. Working working with you guys on this is so much fun. Okay, maybe something like that. Or we do have these. Hmm. Ooh. That's looking pretty. That, that, that might look pretty flipping cool. As long as it doesn't take away... We're okay. You know what I mean? That's the one thing I'm worried about with building is like once I start building too much, I end up just end, like taking away from the whole thing, um, which is never fun. But I kind of want it to look like his teeth. Yeah, see, that's that that ta that doesn't make it look like anything. It just it kind of just ruins it. So not not the biggest fan, guys, not the biggest fan. Um, let's go ahead and, and push it back here. So, you know, we might be able to keep that in the middle. That might be able to stay. Maybe, maybe up one. Oh, but then we have the staircase there. That's kind of good. Okay. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. Uh, we could do cracked here and here. Oops. That, bro that breaks so fast. Um, yo, yo, yo. Recording, working on my, on the front. Why? Ghost squad? It's dark. Oh man, it's dark. Poor, poor Vic, man. Poor Vic. Um, okay, so this is what I also wanted to try. If putting um, black clay behind. <gasps> no. Oh, so sad. Okay, if doing that. Was this you? No. Serious, I am just working on my home. Sorry, Vic, it wasn't me, bro. Vic got trolled. I like, you know what? After the cobweb troll, I'm just, I'm gonna take it easy with the trolling for a bit, guys. I want to get my my stuff in order, and hopefully, I don't make any enemies. Hopefully, no one trolls me, and I won't troll anyone. I just want to help people. I want to get my railroad system set up. I want to get it to the mob grinder. I, you know, I've got way too much to do to be dealing with troll, troll, trolly trolls. You know what I mean? I got way too much I'm working with right now. We got way, we're way too, we, you know, we're just, we're just way too cool for people. Okay. That's, that's pretty much what it comes down to. I'm kidding, guys. <gasps> I'm, just, I'm just joking. Okay. So, uh, let's see what this looks like. Uh, get a little bit of a bird's eye view, um, just to see. Oh, that looks pretty sweet. Okay. That looks pretty sweet. It's looking really... Because it looks like he has horns now. You know what I mean? Like, those really do look like horns. Uh, and if we're coming around the mountain... If we're coming around the mountain... Oh, yeah. Oh, that's looking... That's looking so fresh. I might want to change those two blocks. Maybe to black clay. Uh, let's do that real quick. And... Uh, 
I'm wondering what else we could possibly do to the house. I might take a little bit of a, of a break, you know, walk away for a little bit, grab a glass of water, uh, and then come back. You know what I mean? You, you always have a little bit of a change in perspective when you do that. It's never a bad idea to kind of just step away for a second, you, you know? Uh, black stained clay, perfect. Let's actually make a little bit more. Uh, we got 37 pieces right here. Let's just do eight. Um, boom. Okay, so now we have 10. So let's just step away for a little bit, and then maybe we'll work on our war room for a bit, um, and then just come back another episode and finish up the front, uh, just because I, I want to get it to a place where I'm very happy, but then I always want to just step away for a little bit, read your comments, uh, and see what sort of things that I could possibly do to make it better, um, and listen to you guys uh, for that. So, not, not sure yet. I still don't know how I feel about having lava come down, um, but either way, let's go ahead and just change these up. All right, let's see what that looks like. Mm, I think it's a little too dark. I think that's a little too dark. Let's see here real quick. Yep, 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 yep. Because the stone bricks kept it nice and bright, and it really made the fire pop. So let's go ahead and just... Uh, put it back to the way it was. <gasps> Why can't we just put it back to the way it was? Well, we can, Billy. We're about to do it right now. It's okay. It's okay. You know, we'll keep that the same. But then I think we really want to do like that. Uh, and and leave, leave that. Um, it's probably the best call. What we could do is we could run a wall just like that. That might be pretty cool. That, that might look pretty cool. Just trying to give it some dimension without ruining it, guys. Trying to give it dimension without ruining it. Um, it's a tough, it's a tough game to play, man. It's a tough game to play. Obviously, ruining our wheat. Our wheat farm is down to two pieces of wheat. That's cool. All right. So that's our entrance. Um, it's pretty sweet. I'm very, very. Oh, there we go. You know what? Break, break, break. We're gonna make a new one. We're gonna make a new farm. Uh, but that's that. And you know what? I'm I'm totally not sure what to do for the rest of the part. You know what? Actually, I'm going to do some off-camera work. I think I have an idea of something to do, but it's going to be very much just me playing around with some stuff. I'm going to come back in just a second, and you guys will let me know what you think of what I'm able to get done. All right, guys. So I did a little bit of off-camera work, uh, just kind of hanging out, and voila. There we go. We have the new wolf base. As you can tell, it's got a little bit of a crown lit up all nice. Hello, sheep. Time for you to... You know what? You won't, you're not going to die today. I'll let you live. Uh, but check it out, pretty sweet, added a little bit of a roof to it, obviously we're looking at it from the right side so it's not super kind of uh, straight, but just giving it a little something, also pushed up the mountain a little bit more, um, and overall just giving it a pretty cool look. Uh, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a really big fan. Obviously, if you want me to add anything, let me know. But I like just, it's not too much what I did, but it's just enough that gives it kind of like the form of a head while really look like it's coming out of the mountain there a little bit. But not too much because it's not actually a animal coming out of the mountain it really is just a, a, a castle entrance that looks really cool so uh, the next thing to really work on is this entrance right here this kind of very sad floor pattern as you can tell I got a lot I got rid of the um, uh, granite or whatever was there not granite uh, the the orange stuff whatever uh, so that's been that's been taken care of but I definitely want to add something there uh, I want to add like a harbor what I'll probably do is close up all that water here uh, make it stop here and then add like some boats and stuff like that or maybe just stop it here you know what i mean have all that to be the entrance and get rid of the water there so the water kind of runs right there turns into a harbor uh maybe there's a little farm or something i can have here with with something or, or maybe a little shop or a little hut or something cool uh who knows who knows lots of stuff lots of stuff to be done man lots of stuff to be done but we're gonna be probably stopping work on this thing for now actually i'm pretty happy about where it's gotten to obviously if you have any suggestions or whatever let me know in the comments down below and i'll make changes uh, probably off camera little suggestions here and there and once it actually has a big change i'll, I'll really do an episode about it again but that's going to be that for now but i also want to show you guys the little bit of work i did to the war room uh but to get there i just have to snap my fingers real quick okay teleportation complete uh check it out did a little bit more work figured that cobblestone uh would be the best thing actually for a war room because it shouldn't be super super nice um, but check it out, got my two diamond armor sets. Uh, we can actually fully complete them if we wanted to. Uh, with a diamond sword in the middle, with my best enchanted books right now, which is the sharpness three and the protection three, because we're gonna be getting uh, protection 
4, I realize now, guys, you're right, that there is no Protection 5 in here. But once we get this to Protection 3, we need another Protection 2 book, get that to Protection 3, make that into a Protection 4, etc., etc. Uh, won't take that much longer. Uh, just got to get my mob grinder going. So that's most likely going to be tomorrow's episode. Uh, as you can tell, put some... Co oh, frick! Okay, we're... <laughs> put some cobblestone behind the fire here, the flame. Uh, put the fire cobblestone behind that flame over there. Did a little checkerboard pattern with our lovely... Um, whatever this is called, prismarine glowstone in the middle, which actually moves and does all sorts of cool stuff. Coolest block in the game right now. Super rare. Want to go mine a couple more of those as well. Uh, put the red block uh, on top of that and, and finished up uh, the, the little worms. So it's pretty sweet. Uh, now I need to make just a, a little privacy door so I feel a little bit safer down here. And uh, that's the worm pretty much completed. So I hope you guys enjoyed the episode as well. Got some good work done on the front of the house. Uh, tomorrow's episode will be, I think, most likely working on the... <laughs> Lul. Uh, do, 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 do. Extreme fishing. Um, so the next episode will most likely be working on an XP farmer and hopefully we'll be able to live stream it at around 6 or 7 p.m. EST tomorrow um, or as soon as possible if National Raid Day doesn't take place during then. But either way, thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys later. Take care and stay hot and spicy.